At the end of 2022, I watched RRR and it easily became one of my favorite movies of the decade and I got a ton of recommendations to check out KGF Chapter 1. But did it live up to the hype? In the 1970s, a gangster goes undercover as a slave to assassinate the owner of a notorious gold mine. What's going on guys? My name is Trevor and welcome back to my channel. Let me know your thoughts on KGF Chapter 1 down below in the comments section. Hit the like button, subscribe button, notification bell because we'll have a review for KGF Chapter 2 here in just a couple days. Which I'm very excited to watch and talk about, especially after seeing this movie. So going into this movie, I had a ton of hype around it from how many people recommended it alone. And a lot of people said it's on the level of RRR. And what I do don't think it's on the level as RRR because again RRR is a top 10 favorite movie of the decade so far for me. I still think it stands on its own as another epic awesome movie. This movie's following a character of Rocky who is intimidating and awesome and just bad to the bone. Every time he was on screen I was almost frightened. He's so intimidating and absolutely gangster. It doesn't matter who's in front of him. He's not scared. He's gonna snap some necks and cash some checks and honestly I was here for it. I was like... <laughs> Yes, Rocky! The one thing I took away from the character of Rocky is that he's cool. Like, every time he's on screen, the guys are jealous of him and the ladies wanted to be with him. Rocky's walking around with a cool jacket, his shirt unbuttoned a little bit, not scared of anyone, ready to go at any time. This dude is just action-packed. And the fight scenes with Rocky are brutal. He's putting on whooping on literally anyone who comes after him. And the word starts getting around that Rocky's the guy, basically. He's the guy. And everyone's trying to come after him and come at him, <laughs> No one wants a piece of Rocky. If your name's Rocky, you should just run away after that. I really dug the character of Rocky, but you know what else I dug? The scope of this movie. There's gotta be like a thousand plus people that have been in this movie, from extras to actual cast members to people with lines to people who Rocky was beaten up. The scope of this movie is absolutely insane, and I love that, and I was honestly impressed by that. The scope of the movie was absolutely insane, and the score in this movie is riveting, it's intense, it gets you invested. I'm a sucker for a good score. This movie score was awesome it was fantastic and i'm starting to find this out but there's always like a musical number in these movies like there was one for rrr and there was one in kgf as well and i dug it i thought the music was awesome i thought it was fitting and it felt more like a music video rather than people breaking out into song and a dance felt like Boom, right now, we're breaking down into a KGF music video, and I thought, again, it was cool. While there's also things that I loved about this movie, there's a couple things that I didn't really love about this movie. One of them's the editing choice. There's lots of quick cuts. All of a sudden, Rocky's beating someone up, then he's over here, then he's back over here. It felt almost you're watching a trailer or like a music video just from how fast the cuts were, and it happened a lot. A couple times, I was rolling my eyes at how much the cuts were, and the overuse of slow-mos. It took me out of it just a little bit, made it again, feel like more we're watching a music video. Several times throughout this entire movie, I felt like we were just watching a two and a half hour long music video. Speaking of two and a half hours, for a part one, I think that was a little bit long. I think it overstayed its welcome just a little bit. But at the end of the day, those are all just nitpicks. A couple things I wanted to point out that I wasn't the biggest fan of. I dug a lot about this movie and it set up KGF Chapter 2 oh so well. Like literally, kind of just ended and you're like you know you're gonna get a sequel and it came out last year and i'm so excited to watch it before i give you guys my score let me know your thoughts on kgf chapter one down below in a comment section hit that like button subscribe button notification bell so you don't miss out on my review and reaction for kgf chapter two at the end of the day i dug this movie i thought the action was absolutely awesome i love the scope and the score and the character of rocky was so intense i still get chills just thinking about him not really. Overall, for a score, I'm going to go with 3.5 out of 5. A solid 7 out of 10. I wanted just a little bit more from it, and I think Chapter 2 is going to bring this movie home for me. Again, let me know your thoughts on this movie down below in the comment section. Hit the like button, subscribe button, notification bell, so you don't miss out on a KGF Chapter 2 review. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.